All right, everyone, this is Rambo145. Uh, I wanted to review this Massey Ferguson 7622. It looks awesome. It drives awesome. I've actually used it just a little bit. All right, so let's get in it here. Okay, so here's the beacon lights. There's the front lights, all the other lights, and then no lights. All right. Let's get in here. This thing is so cool. Okay, so you push space bar. And I will give these little controls. So let's open the doors up. Uh, let's go ahead and go up here. You can open the top up. Over here you can do something with some kind of... Uh, I don't know what this is. Not sure what that is. But we're going to just uh, not worry about it. Oh, you can go right here. There's this back window. There's nothing else that I can see that would uh, let you open up. All right. So then, uh, once you go back out, you can actually push the seven on the numpad for the back duels and eight for the back and the front duels. All right. So this is what it. It's like, oh, you can push your five, and it will give you little marker things. I don't know. They don't really do much. They just look for looks, I guess. All right. So you get inside here. This is really cool. Look at this speedometer. Okay, you push, you turn your beacon lights on. You have a little orange flashing thing. Right here. Uh, and then you go backwards. You have a little red arrow around in here. The green means forward, I guess. Alright. The joystick moves over here. I don't know what that's all about. Goes pretty good. Uh, let's do some... Uh, let's go ahead and rake this grass up or whatever over here. Or flip it or whatever the heck you want to call it. Not really sure what this thing does. Ah, oh, about to hit a tree though. All right, so let's uh, open this up. This is a new mod back here too. Ain't, I ain't real sure what this does. Regs it or fluffs it or something, I don't know. All right, so we lower and we turn on. Uh, okay, I was like, where's it going? It's, it's taking my hay. All right, so now let's just go ahead and get in here and do some driving. I saying it, it feels so realistic like I don't, I don't know it's just it's just really cool all right so while we're here let's go ahead and look at these mods all right so here's the tractor it's one hundred thirty five thousand four hundred and sixty five dollars ninety five dollars a day maintenance two hundred fifteen dollars uh, horsepower all right and the windrow is uh, 43000 and $35 a day maintenance and requires 90 horsepower. All right, so that's that. So let's go ahead and uh, get up here at the top of the hill. And then we're going to take and hook a disc on it and see what it can disc. So let's do that. This looks like a good size disc. Let's uh, let's see what it actually does. Let's do this little bit right here. All right, so we lower, lower it, and we can create fields. All right, oh that's cool. It's actually like some kind of red Australian dirt. That's crazy. That's cool. So you can actually uh, create field. Oh, that's nifty. That's really cool, actually. Can't really see much behind you, but I mean, you, you don't have to really 
You can actually just kind of look in your mirrors. Kind of tell if it's doing its job. Alright, so that mod is right here. Cultivator. It's $20,000 and $15 a day maintenance. And it requires power, required power is 300 horsepower. Now that's nuts right there. Alright, so here we go. Let's uh, just create our own little place. Alright, let's see if it'll pull the big one. Alright, I have it. Let's uh, let's just go right here and see if we can unfold it. And then take and plow with it. We'll see how actually how it pulls it. Because I lower it. Um, Lock Creek Field. Okay. Oh. We're on a we're kinda on a hill though, so. It has the power. Just not the weight. <laughs> All right, it don't pull that big one too well. That's a big, uh, that's, that's big actually. All right, so I guess we ain't gonna plow that or pull that. All right, so we know it doesn't pull that. Let's uh, hook up to some trailers. All right, let's hook up to this one. Okay, that one works. How about this one? All right, cool. I think they're different attachers, so. All right, let's do some uh, brush hogging with it. Let's just see how it, what it looks like with this brush hog on here. Cool. cool. All right, let's just drop it here and start cutting. Can we actually see the brush hog? No, we can't. We'll just have to guess where we're going. That, that's pretty cool. All right, that was loud. Uh, I don't know if it will bell hay or not. We could do that. All right, let's uh, turn this on and do some hay. Oh, that little, okay, that mark, that over there, it tells how full you are. That's really cool. It's almost 100%. Okay, cool. It should have kicked the bell out. Uh, okay, it didn't because, that's right, it did a bell. Alright. So that's really cool. You can actually watch that instead of the little icon down there. All right, well, that's the Massey Ferguson and the other things here. Uh, anyway, I will put the link in the description for all of the mods I just used, except for that John Deere one, because I'm not sure where it's at. I have a video up on it, so just search for that John Deere Disc Ripper. And if you don't do that, just ask me. I'll search it, and I'll put the link in. Anyway, uh, hit that like button, subscribe, and share. Thanks. Bye.